Welcome back. In this tutorial, we will learn about polygon command in detail. So, you can give polygon command from here. Click on polygon. And if you want to give from keyboard, then you have to give POL. The short from keyboard, the shortcut is POL. So, click on polygon. Then enter the number of sides, how many you want. Suppose I want 6, enter, then specify the center point of polygon. Then choose the method inscribed or circumscribed. Suppose I want inscribed, inscribed in circle, then he is asking me specify radius of circle, suppose I give 3 radius. Now the inscribe in polygon, inscribe in circle means the circle is drawn with within the circle as a reference suppose suppose we create some circle and this circle will be used as a reference so the distance actually we, whatever radius we have given that is the radius from center to one corner point if you give this dimension also from center to one corner point is 3 so we have given this dimension so this inscribed in circle polygon should be used when you have corner to corner distance that means suppose if you have any opposite to corner distance then you can use the inscribed in circle polygon method that means when you have corner to corner distance that means you have the radius of the external circle and this distance is defined as the diameter of the circle therefore we are using inscribe method for corner to corner dimension same way if we create by another method polygon then number of side 6 enter then center of polygon then suppose we create it by circumscribed about circle and again we give the radius of suppose 4 that means it is created outside the circle suppose if we create the inside circle so this polygon will be created outside the circle that means whatever dimension we give radius dimension that will be the dimension between center or center of the polygon and midpoint of one edge so whatever four distance we are given that is the from center to the midpoint of the edge that means this method should be used when you have face to face distance opposite parallel face distance when you have this distance at that time you have to use circumscribe method and if you are corner to corner you have to use inscribe method that means this distance is the diameter of the internal circle therefore we are using that method and the third method is edge method so again polygon then number of sides suppose I give for you then specify center of polygon now if we want to create a polygon by edge method then don't click the center point because if we click the center point it will go for inscribe and circumscribe method but we don't want that so you can click on edge here you will have to click on edge option here then you have to specify the first endpoint of edge where you want to create the polygon so you give the first endpoint click here then to make it straight click on ortho mode on click then give the direction where you want to give, go and then specify the length of the edge suppose I give it 4 that means in this case length of each edge will be 4 if you give the, this dimension that means each edge length will be 4 you can also use polygon to create triangle also triangle or sphere you can also create triangle suppose if you want to create triangle click on polygon then give the number of edges as 3 enter then suppose I give edge method give the first point then give the distance length of the equilateral triangle suppose 5 so it will create a equilateral triangle of edge length 
for you. If you check the age length, the age length is for you. Same way you can also using polygon, you can also create square also. Give the polygon, then number of sides 4, again age method, give the first point, give the direction and distance of 5. So in this way, we can use the polygon command to create different object and specific polygons. So thanks for viewing the video, we will stop here.